Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, welcome. Or if you know me by my Instagram handle or anything like that, it's time to learn. And make sure you guys comment, like, and subscribe. If you're new here, if you're back, welcome back. I know it's been a while, and honestly, things have been crazy since the whole coronavirus thing started. But we move. We move. So if you've been wondering what it's like being a new graduate, oh wait, let's just stop for a second and all this that word. <laughs> yeah, it has finally finished, and honestly, what a long two years. <laughs> It wasn't that long and it wasn't that bad but honestly like yeah like what a ride especially the ending with how everything like ended and how like covid kind of took over and shut down the entire world like it definitely i don't know if that's like a plus or like a minus but overall like yeah totally crazy um so basically i've been here in quarantine for weeks now just because like, everything's been shut down and because you know when working with children who like are really vulnerable um they don't know how to physical distance or show social distance or whatever so yeah things got locked off and i've just been here like in quarantine just kind of like not really twiddling my thumbs because like i've been doing like little little things to keep me like entertained but yeah i'm just here gonna talk about just a little update what i've been up to um some things you guys should check out if you're in quarantine like myself not being able to work and just kind of like what do i do with all this extra time so if that's something you're interested in then stay tuned okay so we're just gonna jump right in one of the things that i've been doing is reading and um yeah if you've been watching my videos you know that the last placement i was in was really challenging and i had a lot of um varying behavior difficulties in my class Bruh. so i'm reading this book here it's called time out by leanne shaw now this is a great book because i've learned so much from this book but not really because i've learned a lot in my placement but this book just kind of like solidified everything that i learned in my placement um it's about a spec ed teacher that only has spec ed one by the way and basically what she gets she gets pulled randomly one day because a teacher quits his job midday he's like no i'm not i'm not dealing with this gets pulled has has to teach this behavior class with four boys and these boys are so rotten in the beginning but throughout the book you get to know the boys and you get to know the teacher and like i'm only halfway through so i can't spoil the end for you if i wanted to but it's so far it's a great book um this and the other book i have um i wish a teacher would know or something like that two good books but this one for sure is like it's really good like it's good for behavior management tips and skills as well as like like uh giving you busy giving you something to do something to read so definitely this one this other book that i've been Actually, I never got to read it because I literally just got it in the mail and I'm really upset because it came like tore up. So Amazon, like, what are you doing? Sorry, Michael Todd, he is a pastor. He runs a church um, called Transformation Church and he just came out with this book. Um, it's been getting a lot of hype. So I figured, okay, let me grab it. It was on sale. Maybe it's still on sale. So if you're um, into this, then definitely grab it. Um, it's about relationships and dating, stuff like that. I mean, I'm young. I got all this time rather just read how to do stuff right <laughs> bruh <laughs> oh god okay but no like seriously like yeah um it's supposed to be like a really great book and he's a pastor so you know guiding you through the right path and on the right path and stuff like that so this is my next read once i finish that i'll be finished leanne's book like a day day and a half if i really like sit down and then this is the other book that i'm gonna start the other thing I've been doing is Animal Crossing. Actually, no, I'm not even ashamed. I don't care. It's a great game, and honestly, the amount of hours I put into that game is kind of embarrassing. But I love the game. It's so much fun. It's so relaxing. It's literally like one of the best games that I have played in a long time. It's for the Switch. So if you don't have a Switch, Try to find one now. I know it's really hard to find switches right now, but if you do get lucky and be able to find one, 
definitely get Animal Crossing. Amazing game. 10 out of 10. Love it to death. Gonna play forever. And apparently they have updates for the next three years. So once you do finish your island, which my island's only four stars. Once I get a five star, maybe I'll do like a little island tour and like show you guys what my island looks like. It's nothing crazy, but like, yeah. Um, once I get five stars, then I can continue playing throughout the year with the new stuff that's going to be coming in. So I'm really excited about that. Last thing I've been doing is prepping for interviews. Um, it's a little bit early still. I know a lot of school boards mostly get down to it in like June when like we're like qualified by like our certifying boards and stuff like that. But um, I've been prepping. Um, our school did pretty good with like helping us out with questions and like we even did like a, a speed dating interview kind of prep thing which was really fun but awkward <laughs> but um yeah they, they did a great job of prepping us for interviews and even though we practiced this we're never really sure um what they're gonna ask us so what i've been doing is just really getting to know my resume back to front which is kind of weird because like it's me on the paper but like you know um really drawing out those specific um because they always ask for specifics like oh tell us about a time when you did this and then you don't want to sit there and be like hmm and you know good and well you did it but you just can't think because there's two principals sitting in front of you waiting for you to draw out something so you know just really like thinking about those times when you used those targeted skills is something that i'm trying to work on and something that it's gonna take some time to work on again i'm no professional like you guys are watching me throughout my journey as i go through it so that's just really what i'm doing um if any of you guys are interested maybe like somewhere on my screen or i'll like put some of the interview questions that i've heard so far and that i think are really good for you to just kind of know off the top of your head and that you can just like just say um other than that this paper is pretty good and i have another one so yeah that's kind of what i've been doing just like, a lot of reading gaming prep i mean there's not much i can do because again covid19 but yeah um if you made it to the end of this video thank you um please stay safe stay indoors stay happy outside is beautiful so if you do go outside make sure you go for a walk that's for sure you know but thank you for watching this video if you liked it make sure you comment like and subscribe and i'll see you guys in the next one bye